Uh, are we officially podcasting again? Yeah, we are officially podcasting again. This is uh, still season three now. We're in like episode two. You know, remember last year we gave up whole count because it gets too complicated. Yeah, but we're professionals now. <laughs> Like, I can leave the background music in the background. You got to tell them who, uh, who we got with us today? Uh, yeah, we have you, Michelle, almost dirt perfect. Uh, we have the lovely Miss Jenna. Yes. We have the wonderful man behind the scenes. Mm-hmm. We have myself, Jason. So what is the subject of today's podcast? I don't know. You haven't told me yet. I feel like you know. I'd love that. to know this answer, too. Yeah. I figured we should talk about why we are still buried. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, All right, well, you don't need me here. That, that's <laughs> her because, topic? Because I want to know the answer to this. Oh, I figured Lord. this. there's no better platform. We got our marriage therapist here. Right here. All yep. I can say, the I'm weirdest here. thing right now is your microphone is the lowest. <laughs> that's never happened before. You know what I like? Is they're going to be here, and this is going to be the longest they've sat next to each other since... I don't know, three months, four months. When did y'all get married? <laughs> <laughs> like 17 years ago. All right. Setting records. Oh, listen to you. You oh. don't even have the right count. But go ahead. We've been, how long have we been together? I mean, we've been together more than that, but we have not been married that long. We've been married 16 years in April. Yeah. 21st, 2.37 mm-hmm. p.m. What time? I just told you what time. <laughs> <laughs> Repeat that are one more not, time. Are your, are your headphones not working? Yeah, they're working. One more time. What time? Two thirty-seven p.m. That's the day my life changed forever. Still to, to be determined on better or worse. Was this really two thirty-seven? I don't know. We got married at two. She I won't mean, know. She was the already The ceremony drunk. started at. She two had to get drunk so. to marry me. I was obviously. not drunk to marry you. You want to tell them about? I say obviously, right? Yeah. I don't. We don't need to air all of this. Can we talk about our trip to Louisville? No. <laughs> If I turn this off, can we talk about your trip? <laughs> it's not recorded. We can talk about it. That's the whole purpose, though. You forget I'm a teacher. We don't need to talk about all those things. Nobody, nobody at your school listens to this stuff. <laughs> Just saying. I feel like you've been wrong about that in the past. <laughs> it may be true. So. Yeah. All right. So anyways, yeah, I we have no plan on this. We're just... Uh, we're all here, so we figured we'd just sit mm-hmm. down and record something, I guess, is the best way to go about this. That's usually how they and go. Jenna says, I got a plan. I'll take the lead on this, so we're ready. all yours. <laughs> no, that <laughs> is not how this works. I am in charge of Mrs. Dirt Perfect's page, not in charge of this. We want to tell them about Mrs. Dirt Perfect's page? Sure. I have a channel. It's called Mrs. Dirt Perfect. <laughs> Are you editing and posting your own videos now? Yes, I am. Oh, really? Mm-hmm. That's awesome. You know what the amazing part is? People actually watch him. I and people it. don't like him on my channel. Yeah, I don't, which really? is awesome. People don't like him the on people there. People on her channel think I'm the biggest butthole ever. It's funny, though, because they talk, the comments <laughs> that they leave, they talk like they're talking to you, like it's your video. Yeah, a lot of it's funny because a lot of people get on there. But then they don't like you either. It's really funny, though, because a lot of the comments on her channel, they think they're watching my channel. Yeah. They don't realize it's a different channel. That's how this channel is. Yeah. They, yeah. Comment, <laughs> they comment like they're talking. Like, I get so many comments like, um, they, the latest one I posted was Gunner, you guys racing. Yeah. They wanted to know the difference in the engines. I don't know, Aster. The only Perfect difference is the weight. I weigh more than Gunner. <laughs> and well, a better driver. No, they all think that if Gunner had the same cart as you, he'd beat you. He can drive my car and I'll still beat him in his. I don't know if I can fit in his seat, though. <laughs> well. So if you guys haven't seen this video, we went up to the go-kart track and we had this plan. I was going to start in front of Gunner. I was going to see how many laps it would take me to lap him. I thought like five, six, seven laps at the most. That little shit's fast. It took me like 18 laps. I'm like, I ain't got the stamina for this. I'm done. Yeah, you did it twice. It was like. Like by the time I called him, my tongue was hanging out. I'm like, I'm over it. Yeah. So how's that going with your uh, your son getting into go-kart racing? Better now. Yeah. <laughs> Our first outing was interesting, to say the least. Yeah. He, uh, he about tunneled out the go-kart, and there was a pretty violent crash. Didn't he pit you once? Huh? Did he pit you? Gunner? Yeah. No, I think no. that's whenever uh, he spun out and Gunner went to avoid. He, did he hit Colton, did he? He hit Colton. Oh, that's yeah. right. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I was His wreck. first race outside of our track... He hit a kid spun out and he hit the kid and the kid flew out of the cart. Yeah, it oh. was. So it was. Uh, yeah, the kid should have seatbelt on. <laughs> I mean, you know, I think there should be seatbelts. So go karts. A lot of people comment about that. Why the go karts don't have seatbelts? It's kind of the motorcycle theory. 
You jump and run. Yeah, they, you just you get away from it if mm-hmm. they get hit hard enough. I don't know if it's right or wrong, but you get into you get into cars with roll cages, then it changes, and then yeah. you go to five point harnesses. But that scared me. I was ready to give it up. <laughs> from the oh, from that <laughs> incident. Yeah, I was not a fan. This is Gunner's first year doing it. He did good. We, you know, he was nervous the first couple of races, but once we got rolling with it, he was. He's really yeah. fa- he's really fast by himself, mm-hmm. but he uh, we got to teach him how to race. Mm-hmm. Well, he races you differently than he races the other. Yeah, he ain't afraid to rough me up. He won't rough nobody else up. <laughs> up here, it's different. When he goes somewhere else, he just gets yeah. nervous. Okay, but that's man. like everything. Macy's the same way when she plays basketball. She gets nervous during yeah. games, like it is. Now, would you say that the kids are as competitive as, as their father? Yeah, they're cheaters. Yeah. Oh, what? No, what? That's not the question. <laughs> it's the Simon family. That's how they all are. You get it from your mother. You think I'm competitive? She won't. Yes, you're competitive. Paula is competitive. Oh, so is that a question? It's hard for, for us? me to. It's Your hard children are competitive. He's competitive, yeah. He's competitive, yeah. and then he cheats and gets bigger motors than everybody else in his go kart. Yes, well, yes. Yeah. You're a cheater. No, Macy tries no, to cheat minute. at every board game. There, how card can I game cheat when there's played. no rules? There are rules. <laughs> no, there's no rules. There are yes. Her. No. Yes. yes. No. Yes. No, there's no, it's my track, my rules. The rule is there's no rules. <laughs> the there are no rules. There are rules at my track. <laughs> yeah. The rule is there's no rules. Oh, that's still a rule, though. The, so there's one rule. There's no rules. <laughs> <laughs> no, but it's been fun. It's been fun seeing Gunner, Gunner go yeah. at it. So, but, uh, so let's, uh, speaking of the devil, look who just showed up. <laughs> what are you what doing? Needs, sir? Nothing. Nothing. Mm-hmm. Okay. Go ahead, back in the house. <laughs> <laughs> so let's talk about uh, let's talk about <laughs> YouTube. That's what we're going to talk about. YouTube. Okay, we want to talk about YouTube. Look at you guys. You guys are all confused about what's happening. I feel I like I feel like that we're confused. We're terrified. I don't yeah. know, like what's happening. Well, I want to get your take. So we covered this in the last podcast about this a little bit. I come in the house, told you I was going to do YouTube. I feel I like we've had this conversation you, five thousand okay. times. They're going to see the real sides of it. Will you listen to let me get to my point? I'm just saying people know already. <laughs> <laughs> you thought it was going to be a phenomenal idea. He laughed. He didn't want to do it. I got it. Yeah, Man, right. Stop exactly. Stop going this conversation. Okay, carry people. on. Oh, sorry. My mistakes. Will you please be nice to me? Always. <laughs> so this is the question. So we've been doing this for a while now. Mm-hmm. How many years? I don't know. Four? Almost four? I don't Almost know. Five. Almost five. Almost five. Five? 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 Be five oh. in November. We've known you for that yeah. long. <laughs> no, 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 I just mean it doesn't seem like it's been five years. Yeah, that's her takeaway really? from this. I've known you that long. Yeah, it doesn't seem like that. At least that's she good. acknowledges my presence. Yeah, is that me? Yeah, you just skip over me for everything. I do. Yeah, oh, purpose. See? He doesn't love me. See, you have the better Simon over here. No, the better Simon boy. So, my question was going to be before I really got interrupted as normal. Is uh, what? <laughs> what was that sound? I didn't hear. Yeah, you nailed it. You nailed it. Yeah. <laughs> I I'm getting teamed up on here. <laughs> you want to try? That's again? right. I got. <laughs> I got. I got two people on my side. Yeah. I'm pretty sure. So, so this, I want to get this from your perspective. Are you ready? Yeah. How has YouTube changed our life in the last four years? Five good, years. bad, good, bad, ugly, pros, cons. Hold on, yards. Um, First off, was it anything you... That's a loaded question. I know. Okay, okay. What are you going to say? I said, has it been what you thought it was going to be? Something completely different? Well, it was completely different than what I thought it was going to be. I did not think you were going to be as successful as we've (laughs) had this conversation before. So you thought I was doomed for failure? I mean, yes. Mm -hmm. Not doomed for failure. I just did not think you were going to get... To where you, we have watchers out there. Um, I did not think you were going to get to where. Okay, shh. So you did. So you did not think I was. You thought I was going to be a failure. Pretty much, yeah, 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 yeah. I just didn't think you were going to get. This as is many. the support system I have at home, folks. I did not I think mean, you were going to fail. I just did not think you were going to get as big of a following as what you have, because you. Do not like to take pictures. You do not like to be in front of a camera, or you did not prior to yeah. this. Did not. 
And I still don't. There's one exception, though. You also, I mean, the one thing you had going for you is you could talk to a brick wall. So <laughs> <laughs> here we Not are. only that, he could debate a brick wall and win. Okay, yeah, this is true, too. So, I mean, you had that going. Yeah, so. yeah, yeah, but debating it with a brick wall, the only reason he wins is he's got the equipment to take it down. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yes. Well, there goes yes. back to that cheating part. Yeah, yeah, yeah. the cheating part. I mean, you know. He's just come full circle yeah. to cheat. <laughs> <laughs> I'll show you wall. <laughs> so okay, so you didn't think why did why did you not think I was gonna have the success? Because I did not at the time I didn't know YouTube was I don't know, like people watch it like TV. I did I didn't ever watch YouTube like that. I mean we had a neighbor. I never really you. even used YouTube prior to you being on it. We had a neighbor's done YouTube for a long time. I mean yeah. But I don't know. So what makes you think, well, what's your opinion of why it actually ended up being a success? The brick wall thing again. Are you wanting to me to like pat you on the back? No, and like, that's job, not. I'm honey, trying to get. Great. I'm trying. <laughs> Is that to what you're trying to get out of me here? Because I said, good job. You're doing great. That's not Proud what I'm getting you. out here. I'm trying to figure out. I want, I truly want your perspective of how it's changed the family and what you expected versus what it is. Hmm. Okay. Well, honestly, I didn't expect anything out of it. I'll have to be. I'll have to. Uh, I'll have to agree with that. Because I didn't know anything about doing YouTube or what you got from it or any of that. I didn't expect to meet any of the people that we met. Hi. <laughs> hey. <laughs> um. I didn't expect to have as many experiences as what we have. And I mean, you go all the time anymore. Not all the time. I'm hope quite a bit. Mm. Mm. Okay. Okay. But we've got to do a lot of things yeah. that we would have not been able to do prior to. It's definitely, uh, whenever I started into it, I had no idea what to expect. I just needed it to, to do enough to justify my time. Yeah. Which it's done. And I mean, you had a goal in mind in the beginning of right, what you wanted it to be. Which we've covered that on. Yeah. Podcast in the past of how. Yeah. How I honestly all that. just didn't think people wanted to watch other people work. Like. <laughs> but I you just, watch other people put makeup on. No, I don't know. I don't know. I think it is. I a mean, kind of I a do, weird but not idea. on YouTube. I don't guess. I, yeah, I, I follow know. things on different me social media. I think it. Ones. I think it fills in that void of reality TV of true reality yeah. TV. Mm -hmm. I think the people biggest want, thing yeah. to help the biggest thing to help people like us on YouTube. Is re reality TV become obviously staged? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I say it's reality TV, but it's real. Yeah. Right. For the right. most part. There's yeah. definitely channels out there where it's not. Right, yeah. right. But, uh, but for the most part, I mean, I tell people all the time, we're not smart enough or good enough to be actors. What you see is what you get. Well, you got a model. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> Don't forget about me. But uh, He's got a calendar. <laughs> <laughs> he's, he's got one month in his calendar. That's the one best month, month in his apparently. calendar. Good start. What month is it? Huh? What month is it? It's, it's apparently what a month? cold month because everything. Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> Not going there. Oh my God. A moment of silence for Hoover's Matt. <laughs> <laughs> no, but it's uh, it's been. Uh, so let me ask you this. It's been good for it's been good for the family overall. Would you say that? Mm -hmm. I mean, the kids have got to experience stuff they would have got to experience without it. We've got to experience stuff we would have got to experience without it. I've obviously got. I mean, the first thing everybody wants to know about us on YouTube is how much money we make, and I'm not obviously going to disclose that. But we make we make enough money to keep to justify our time to keep going. But that's not that's not the big draw i mean the opportunities the people the people you meet is probably the best mm -hmm. thing about youtube yeah yeah uh, i mean even you've met some good friends off yeah. youtube oh uh, <laughs> the second oh, thing yeah. well we already knew him oh but, yeah five years yeah. Hi. Hey. <laughs> but the second thing is the opportunities i mean we've got uh we've got a tremendous amount of opportunities mm -hmm. from uh well and i think for me in the when you do videos with the kids and stuff, that's going to be memories that they're going to have. That's what I like so much about it. Well, so that's kind of where I was going around full circle with this a little bit, even though you made me take the pull and string method to get here a little bit, is, you know, one of the, 
one of the enticing things for me to start YouTube was, you know, a lot of you guys know uh, I lost my dad 20 years ago. And we got home videos of dad. We've got pictures of dad. We got a lot of that stuff of dad. But we don't really have, like, how dad was every day. Right. And, yeah. and all this stuff he did. And, you know, that being able to kind of document my life one day to where my grandkids or my kids can go back or... I mean, I've been doing it five years, and I've still been back and watched some old videos and seen how much the kids changed, how much the equipment's changed, how much the company's changed, how much we've changed. Mm -hmm. You know, I'm, it's just an awesome timeline of what's going on. And then you look at uh, people like Harmless Farmer, that just uh, recently passed away, unfortunately. Mm -hmm. And think about if he didn't start his YouTube channel, like what his family has access to now because he did what he did. Right. You know, that's yeah. uh, that's some memories that are going to... It's as much for the family at that point as what it is for everybody else, but you're able to share it with everybody else and celebrate his life with everybody else. I mean, obviously, I'm not wishing my life away, but, right. uh, you know, if I continue doing this for years and years and years, I don't care if people stop watching at some point. I'm still going to probably do it at some extent just so we got documentation of everything. Right. Home uh, movies, basically. Home yeah, movies. it's... Well, and that's kind of why I do my videos is... You know, and, uh, and like Tracking Time with Tim, stuff. we had mm -hmm. Tracking Time with Tim on the podcast. <coughs> Excuse me, that's exactly why he started his YouTube channel. That was the easiest way for him to share videos of the family with other family members. Mm -hmm. And then that morphed into other people seeing the videos. And he's like, well, maybe there's something here. And just kind of kept on, kept on going with it. So mm -hmm. I guess on that note, I, would, I personally would highly encourage anybody to start a YouTube channel. So... What's your guys' take and opinion, I guess, on having the kids on, on the internet? Because the internet is a vast and strange place. It is. I have never minded it until recent events, probably. Mm -hmm. um, I think. Not the I joke. don't. I don't mind them being on there. It's our family, and right. I, you know, but. When people make certain comments, I'm not mm -hmm. totally fond of that. Mm -hmm. If you don't have nothing nice to say, don't say anything at all. I mean, mm -hmm. I'm, I go by that concept. That, if you is don't so have, too th that is so 1980. I mean, I don't care. I'm a preschool teacher. What do you expect? Like, mm -hmm. if you don't have anything nice, why are you commenting? I right. don't care if you have a rude comment. You don't need to tell me about it. Right. Just keep it to yourself. Um, and I didn't post it for you to make those comments. So I don't like that part of it. Um, and I would say another recent event that <laughs> I don't know if we want to talk about it or not. I'm not real fond of it, but um, I guess that's you know transitioning in. There's the good. There's the good with the bad. Yeah. Yeah. I'm just mm -hmm. kind of yeah. coming at it from my own perspective. Yeah. Like I yeah. keep myself. I mean, most of the time it. it doesn't really bother me. Mm -hmm. I don't mind that they're on there. I, think I mean, it's just part of his life and our life, and that's. I feel like. To get to know him better as a person and a, as a channel, you have to know him and his family. Right. And so I feel like it would be hard to like not show them at all. Mm -hmm. I feel like it would not be showing who he is. Right. Because yeah. he's, you know, I don't know. Does that make sense? Yeah, I, the, I think yeah. to answer your question a little bit deeper, I think it... I didn't go deep enough for you. <laughs> That's what she said. <laughs> <laughs> I was playing on it. Okay, well... <laughs> Carry on, Mr. Simon. That wasn't no, the other it, way it, around. Is, it is a good question because I'm listening to it too. I, I yeah. wonder because uh, you know videos I got. Yeah. You know, they ain't. Uh, I ain't got many of the kids, and you know, yeah. like me and Bo were. You no, know, I was. I was kind of worried. Yeah. Because of the way the world is today. I know. That's yeah, weird. it is. And yeah. honestly, in the beginning, I didn't think much of it. I mm -hmm. was just like, "It's our family. It is what it is." You know. And then I don't know. As as the more he got, I guess, bigger. Yeah. You almost can't take him away from it now because you already yeah. did it. Right. But it does make you think more about. I don't know. The, I, the, at the ages they're at now, I don't really think twice about it because I don't know if this is the right way to put it. They're, they're on the Internet, but they're not fully exposed to everything that goes on on the Internet. You know, yeah. we govern them a little bit. But as they get older, we lose some of that control of what they can see and can't see, and, and they just get older in general. Mm -hmm. I, 
Uh, it's kind of the double-edged sword, you know. Would you just see how them on your channel and control what they're doing? Or, I mean, what keeps them from starting their own channel at some point, dude? I right. Mean, have so, you seen some of these TikToks out there? I don't want that to be what I was saying, going. do you almost feel like this may, may be some kind of subliminal lesson here almost? Yeah, I, I think it's, some, it's setting an example to some extent. Like, I yeah. feel like we... I feel like we internet responsibly. <laughs> Does that make yeah. sense? Almost like a slow introduction to the crazy world that is. Well, you know, social media is crazy, and for young kids, it's like insane mm -hmm. anymore. But so. Like Jenna said, you know, there's there's the commenters. You've always got them. They yeah. don't. Mm -hmm. it, it, we're completely different in that aspect. Like a rude comment does not bother me one bit. It could, drives me bonkers. I could care less. Mm -hmm. I laugh at them. I think they're. I just like. But I think that's the different roles in parenting, too. Like, I'm the mom. Yeah. You go mama bear. I'm, I go sure. mama bear. You comment on my kids, I'm coming after you. Like, mm -hmm. that's just... I mean, a rude, comment, I... a rude comment to me is not... Like, it just shows your ignorance. Mm -hmm. Because there's no way you got enough information out of that video to have that comment. Right? I want to immediately block you. <laughs> yeah. But I don't. But, I mean... I, I have... mean, there are definitely some comments that I could imagine seeing... Yeah. I would immediately block. Yeah. Um, I mean, or, I have blocked yeah. some. I mean, there was a particular video that I got <coughs> pretty upset by because somebody made a comment about Gunner. He's going to grow up and be this terrible kid and oh, all I remember the things. That. Yeah. I don't know. It was, yeah, I remember that. It was that was because they were horse on. playing in the kitchen and he slapped No, her. we were playing basketball out oh, here. Oh, that's right. Yeah, it was basketball. And somebody, he came up and gave me a high five and I said, ow. Mm -hmm. And somebody somebody thought he hit me, and then I was yeah. like, "Did you watch the video? It was a high five. Like, yeah. I've had my and dog then it tackle continued me on. harder than that. Yeah, but okay. So the flip side of that is is all these rude comments and all these negative things about social media are also they're going to get exposed to it at some point. Yeah, yeah, so, right. yeah. We not use these opportunities to you know teach them how to deal with stuff like that. I think right. that's part of the. Part of the issue with society is nobody knows how to deal with it. Everybody wants to live in their own little plastic bubble, and unfortunately, that's not reality. So, right, that's a good point. I, yeah. I hadn't considered that angle. So, I mean, I, I mean, that's my goal in in my own classroom <coughs> is to teach kids how to interact with one another. And if you don't like what somebody says, tell them you don't like right. it, and mm -hmm. be able to handle conflict and that sort of thing. Well, you also and I can handle it. I just if you're gonna nitpick something you can say it to me and not about my kids yeah. well you also you know? don't want your kid to grow up to be that commenter that's yeah. true yeah. yeah yeah you know what i mean so how do you teach him that words do hurt yeah. you know and it, i've come to the conclusion over the years that people that make rude comments are one of two things ignorant or jealous that's pretty safe yeah. safe guess there yeah and i don't know if it's because I'm confident in what I do, or I just know that there's no way to have the opinion you have with what little bit of information you've gathered that I just immediately dismiss them. But mm -hmm. you have a very different personality. Please explain than me. there. Like you just said, you are a very confident, headstrong, I'm gonna argue with the brick wall. And probably win. Yes, person. Mm -hmm. And with if the that bulldozer. <laughs> yeah. with the bulldozer. With bulldozer. Yes, like that's just how you are. Like somebody would argue with you and you will pin their comment to the top because it's fun. It's, 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 it's entertaining for me. Like yeah. if you yeah. if you that attack is not me. if you attack me, it's fair game for me to have fun with you. True. Yeah. You know, and and I'm not saying I, I always win, but a lot of times I come out on top of those arguments. <laughs> yeah. Just I guess I me. have a hard time not taking it personally. Mm -hmm. And that's yeah. probably just a I think that has something thing, to do maybe. with the, uh, I think it has something to do with the way we grew up. My family is very, very. I just made a face there. I just, just want you to explain. <laughs> well, what my, does that mean exactly? Uh, at least the part of the family I grew up in, there's no holds bar. It's, it's cut and dry. Leave your tears oh, at the doorstep. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, that uh, makes sense, I guess. I'm not saying my parents didn't love me, but it was... You also had brothers. Yeah. You had no I, sisters I had no to sisters. I grew with, up so with two brothers. Very different. Mm -hmm. So it was, it was kind of a... And my mom, I mean, we've had mom on the podcast, but she's not a loving... 
Oh, she's I mean, now loving she's Beverly. very loving. She is loving. Mom, I hope you watch this. She has yeah. three rambunctious she has, boys to but she raise. Has okay. zero. So basically, in about March, yes, they're perfect we, to we have a black guy. Yeah. <laughs> There's gonna be so, a black guy on the channel. But she has zero tolerance for BS. I guess that, that's yes. the best way to put okay. it. Okay, that's uh, a good way to yeah. put it. Zero she tolerance for BS. She had to be like BS. that, though. Yeah. Yeah. Gro- raising three boys. She I had mean, to if be you that were, way. if you went crying in the house whining because my house that had three boys and I mean three girls and one boy. I went around in the house and my brother hit me. My mom would say, well, good thing it didn't hit you harder. Yeah. <laughs> you know, like, just suck it up yeah. and go yeah. on. But uh, I, so I think, I, you know, the way we were raised probably had a little bit to do with that. Yeah. My, the side of the family I take after, which is my mom's side of the family, they're all a bunch of headstrong driven individuals that I, I think at some point we almost go, would you say we go through life with blinders on? Like we get focused on something and it's just go, go, go. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Go, go, go. And that's one thing, I guess, opposite the track, because she's the opposite. You know, we'll be go, go, go. Oh, look, flowers. Oh, look, this. And I'm like, mm-hmm. focus. I go and shop with her. If I go to Walmart to get Squirrel. crackers, if I go to Walmart to get crackers, I go to the cracker aisle, I get crackers, I pay for them, and I walk out. There's a meme about that that's hysterical. <laughs> she goes to Walmart yeah, to get not, crackers. She'll have that. a whole cart full of stuff, get to the car, and forget the crackers. Right. Yep. That's exactly, mm. yes. I have to do lists. I make a list and leave it at home. <laughs> I, put it on my phone. I mean, I don't ever, I can't. So, yeah. so you make that list. You just want to make sure that you get everything that you yeah. thought was on that list yeah. and mm-hmm. you just forget them crackers. Maybe yeah. just the crackers. Yeah. Yep. And I have to make 50 trips to the store because I forgot everything that I went in for the first Drives time. Me that was me yesterday. Crazy. Y'all need to get the store closer to my house. <laughs> <laughs> I think it'd be easier to move the, the uh, house move closer the house to the store. I beg to differ. <laughs> so, uh, Maybe if I can make a suggestion, put the list as number one item on the list. <laughs> I mean, maybe so. Yeah. I have just never been a list kind of girl. I, I mean, now at work, mm-hmm. post notes from my friend. I write things down See, and I put it on my desk. I use the, the notes app because now you can do yes. the check marks and I like checking things. Yeah, just, there's something. See, satisfying. I don't. I mean, I have my phone at work, but I have little people <coughs> right. that I'm with all day long. Right. This goes so, into another sticky notes on my desk. This is more for shopping. Yeah. So like, okay. um, this is shopping our, tips from Jason. Shopping tips. Yeah. Yeah. So like, this was our pack list to get out here. Ashton oh, and I share this look list. Look at you. Yeah, and then when you come down further, That's it's a like big list. Well, yeah, it's like Walmart trip one through five from yesterday. <laughs> 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 but yeah, you know. So. I mean, what, you know, maybe thing I we, should be a list person. I'm also not like the type of person that makes a menu for the week and goes grocery <laughs> shopping based on oh, the no, menu no, no, and no, what no, we no. cook. No, we don't do that crap either. We don't do that. Yeah. I've we, tried that yeah, one Yeah, you know time. what Jenna did last time she went grocery shopping? <laughs> Can we tell this story? I don't care. So, basically had a ball game, right? Uh-huh. We all go to the ball game. It's like 6 o'clock on a Saturday afternoon. She's like, hey, I need to pick up some groceries. That's not accurate. She exactly. had practice. Whose story is it? She had okay. practice. No, she had a game. <laughs> she had a game. We were in a game. It was Saturday night game. Okay, carry on. Whatever. I don't She's remember. like, I'm going to go to this new store in Jasper. I said, okay, fine. I'll take her and go home. Six hours later. That's accurate. That's a big store. It's she rolls Jasper. In, it's she rolls like into the Jasper. house. She has one bag of groceries from the Dollar General store. <laughs> To clarify, and she kept I, trying to say, I said I was going shopping, not grocery shopping. I said the only reason you went to Jasper was to go grocery shopping. I told you that there was a new store I wanted to go to, and then I was going to get groceries. I went to the new store and decided she I was too to tired believe. to go to groceries, so I went to the Dollar General that was right next to the store I just left. She led to me believe the then, new store was a grocery store. I didn't. You just chose to believe it that way. <laughs> you didn't tell me anything any different. <laughs> but I did Are you assuming something with not enough information? Yeah. Well, so here's one thing where Jen and I are way different. It's, <laughs> it's well, I mean, like we could not be more opposite. It's called time management. He is not wrong. <laughs> <laughs> I can maximize every minute, every second of the day. I am the biggest procrastinator you will ever meet. And then whenever she tells me she didn't have time and I sit her in there scrolling on her phone for hours. Eating, I don't do that. That goes to me like a rusty nail. 
See, I told you the name of this podcast. This is why we're still married. <laughs> you want me to list all the ways that drive you crazy? Oh, yeah, let's hear it. Come on, let's you? go. Let's go. Oh, I got it. You, your, well, your list is so short. Now, if we're going to do this and... and we marriage got our marriage counsel. therapist there. If I have yeah. to step in, I will. Okay. It's been very calm. I've seen good smiles out of yeah, both of you. So. Look at us. I haven't thrown the yes. F-bomb one time no, so far. Uh-uh. I, already, I have a picture. I got to edit it out of the first podcast because someone slipped. You said yeah. a bad yeah. word? Yeah, yeah, you did. Yep. It I, wasn't even me. <laughs> it must have been a good moment. Yeah, good I, got the, I got the time stamp. But if we start talking about things that drive me crazy, we might accidentally. Well, hold on. If the we're going to get into knows this. I drive you crazy. <laughs> 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 we have the marriage counselor mm-hmm. on hand. I'm going to yes. referee this. Okay. We yeah. have a referee and a counselor. Yes. Yes. Right. Now, Miss Jenna. You listen nicely to the story, so we got to do it the same way, you know. Okay. Do you, okay. Yeah. So, do you want a white flag to surrender? And <laughs> I'll start the whole conversation. I've been without no, socks. No, 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 no. See, oh, this is it. No, oh, no. See, Jenna, it's Miss Jenna's turn. No, it's all right. You all complained about my house. shopping trip. Yeah. So okay. now, now you have to listen. Let's go. All right. I'll so go Jenna, shopping we're gonna you. let you. Let's let you get yes. started on it. Where here. should I start? You is the problem. Well, time began. I know. When we first met. Yeah. This one over here does no laundry, does no housework of any kind. I will built drink the damn house. chocolate uh, milk. Uh, no, Janice you don't talking. get to talk. Yep. Is this like a mediator? You do not uh, get to talk. It's how it works. Oh, that's all right. I'll, 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 I'll bundle it you up over here. You will drink Pepsi's. <laughs> Make a list. I'll be like a truth about Chocolate <laughs> milk and leave this much chocolate milk in the bottom of the Pepsi, in the bottom of the cup. That must have to be in the bottom of the can, too. And just leave it wherever you drank it at. <laughs> oh, like, for a few line. examples. Found a Pepsi can sitting on the back of the toilet the other day. <laughs> oh, oh, okay. Sorry, I said that as you took a drink. My bad. Hey, I got a sidetrack taking a poop. I had to set it down to wipe. Found a Pepsi in the shower. I wasn't done yet. I was had my, my time management. Okay, people. Take the last, as time management, the last couple of gulps of the shower, I go ahead and start getting Shut up, This is great. We have the end table, okay. not the end table, the bedside table. We have, you know, iPad batteries galore, all the things, a roll of toilet paper to blow our nose 50,000 times, Pepsi cans, <laughs> chocolate milk cups. We spill a chocolate milk cup. You want to tell why we spilt it? You did it. Well, uh, yeah, I guess I was doing it. All right. <laughs> okay. I, no, that is not even. Uh, well, your well going? we're not talking. Uh, the, the, you well, don't get to speak. It, I mean, in it, fairness, it, how much actually spilled if he's, if he's only leaving a little bit? <laughs> <laughs> so Jason, spill. you're on my uh, side. I'm sorry, Miss Jenna. Stop talking. It's <laughs> me. <laughs> um, so we had, and let's see, how many um, wrappers on our, te- we don't clean up after ourselves. We open our food, it stays. Where Look how many Pepsi cans are on this table right here. Y'all have seen his office. There's one on the floor too. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> one here, one here, one here. There are three. He left one in Ashley's All truck. given by him, drank by him. He was supposed to get that out for me. I got it, don't worry. This is how our house is too. Mm-hmm. And he's a 41 year old man and he has two children. If do somebody... you think they do exactly what he does? If somebody had better time management skills, they'd have time to clean all that up. <laughs> Get them. Oh, I am yeah. looking at both of you. I yes. mean, come Get on. Get them. <laughs> no, you can. You, it, you're. Uh, you're <laughs> you talk. I, he can wait. I mean, he can wait. any woman anywhere would not put up with any of that you got a funny way of saying how thankful you are you're married to me Mm-mm, that's not what i was saying at all you read that wrong buddy big time is it my turn yet we don't do laundry either did i say that because y'all see his clothes in his videos so you she know got, how but we do fix the washing machine Man's got broke. a point. Okay, you did fix it. Yes, what but to- it is clogged nine times out of ten because of this nonsense. No, no, I have no. Been, no. What did we find in that washing machine, okay, Mr. Man behind the scenes? Some socks. Okay, whose I socks have been were asking, they, Mr. Man behind the scenes? They were your big toe socks. <laughs> <laughs> I've been asking for a separate washer and dryer for his, for his stuff. Okay, I mean forever. I've been asking for a shower out here in this shop to degrease this. Before he goes into my house, forever. Mm-hmm. You, you can, uh, 
you can take the wash and washer and dryer out of our house if you want. We're already going to take the no fridge. But we say no to that. <laughs> huh? So we're already going to take your fridge. Whatever. So <laughs> they got like four of them down there so now. So I agree with that because I might. You need use a that shower. Too. Yeah. 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 You know. So you might want to wash your clothes. I got to do all the work, and I'm all greasy. So she I gets mad at me. She's here. like, "What are you going to do if I stop doing your laundry?" I'm like, "Simple. I'll call my grandma." So yep. she stopped doing my laundry one time. I called grandma. She came out and picked it up. That was the best smell of laundry I ever had. <laughs> I mean, somebody, do you know why our laundry hasn't got, had smelly goodness for a long time? Because bad. of your children. Somebody yeah. got mad. Macy can't have that stuff on her laundry. But I'm just telling you, I've got alternatives. To, i got alternative solutions. I'm crafty. I don't, I don't do my laundry. But do you do any housework? Yes, I do. Okay. That's fair help. then. I do help. You help work. out. You don't have to do your laundry. Yeah, I do. If all you this. helped up, you did not. You you know nothing. Oh. The thing about this is, it was supposed to be. I take care of the inside. inside? He yeah. takes care of the outside. outside. But no, That's listen, I... listen. What has happened? See now. <laughs> listen the, to what has happened. The problem with this though is there's definitely a video of <laughs> Jenna cutting grass. Whoa, yes. Whoa, 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 whoa. I oh, weed get... eat, gunner weed eats, I yeah. do the weed killer, I do all the things. All you do is get on a freaking lawnmower with your Pepsi and drive around. And leave, right. the, and leave the Pepsi yeah, on the mower. In, and leave in. the Pepsi on the mower. You don't hey, even take the need... trash out half the time. <laughs> I, yep. If you can't see this, I'm pointing to man behind the scenes. Because he does it. <laughs> well, I mean, that's how I got his title. But I need, okay. <sighs> <laughs> so this, no, 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 you don't even know what to say you right guys now. don't realize this but this is kind of like marriage counseling for me yeah. how did you get her Same. to mow the grass <laughs> i need to know i like to mow the grass yeah ashton does too she just <laughs> but i don't like the hill like, yeah, she yeah. That she don't don't see the what she she's leaving out a very crucial detail in our marital agreement you mm -hmm. forgot. Yes, I even brush hogged up there. Is that the one you're talking yeah. about? Oh, yeah. yeah. A video. I ran it out of gas, but I still did it. This is true, and I had to come rescue. There's a very crucial detail. And you left me hanging because you had to rescue her. <laughs> Miss Jenna, I thought we were on the same side. <laughs> so the Sorry, I needed help. I had we, this much to go. Whenever we got married, we agreed on two things. Oh, gosh. I yes. told her I was going to be self employed, so she needed to carry the insurance. And I have done so this entire time. And I have not disagreed with that one. With thing. honor. That's right. I said, I built the house, you take care of it. I've done that. That was never an agreement. Oh, no, yeah, that was it. I built it, you take care of it. No. So that wasn't part, no inside, outside. Nope. That was, the inside all, and outside, all. yeah, the inside so, and outside was a conversation. But yes. I feel like that's an unspoken rule. The outside yeah. has not been taken care of. If you guys looked the at outside, all, in my garage, <clears throat> in my, if you looked at my garage up until last week, Half of it was filled with cardboard boxes because it uh -uh, didn't do his job to take there them out anywhere. There was a burn ban. The government shut me down. It was uh, shut down for a week. It was oh. shut down for a month and a half. So it was not. Cardboard, last, I remember, do you recycle it? Yeah. yeah. Don't you remember that the last podcast? The, and it the was cardboard right bar gets in the trash. The what? Cardboard bar in the trash. Don't you remember the last podcast? No. <laughs> he was sleeping over there. Um, yeah, yeah. I'm starting we to wake this. up now because not just me being the it's, marriage yeah. counselor here. It's like I'm getting counseling for my marriage. So, right. <laughs> Needless to say, but, is okay. And another point. We got her fired up now. She's rolling. I, li I mean, I literally do for everything for the man. This is not everything. Fair. I wake our children up. I make the breakfast. I get them ready for school. I take them to school. I go to work. I pick them up from school. I take them to all sporting events every single time, all the time. No, I pick them up. I make back. sure they have clean clothes. I feed them. I put them to bed. I do all of it. Uh, it's like a single parent household over here. She gets so mad because she can't get the kids to do anything. I come home. Immediately take their phones and I said, that's it. We're cleaning the garage. Because <laughs> what you don't understand. Yeah, that really irritates the tar out of me. And don't come out here and work two or three hours with me. Help me clean the garage. Do it awesome. And I've been yelled for I don't know how long in the house. Because I am the parent 95, 99.9999% of the time. And you walk in 
and choose to pick a battle and take Macy's phone and boom, she got to come out here because she wants her phone back. I don't take her phone immediately. I give her the option to come peacefully. Once she don't come peacefully, <laughs> she comes now, by force. Have you tried this, Matthew? You, what, yes, and you know what happens when he takes the phone? She cries to me that daddy took the phone. Or Gunner cries to me because daddy did this or daddy did that. He they, does it and then leaves. Therefore, this parent has to deal with all of it. I can almost, I can almost watch my watch about five and a half minutes till they come out of the shop. Well, have you, have you tried it's taking so the phone and then making them go cry to him? They don't cry to him. Remember how I was raised? I am, they don't cry to him. He no, I know. That's what I'm saying. So if you want the house clean, you take the phone, they cry to him, it gets them nowhere, they have to clean the house, no? No. Oh. I don't know. I was just, I I'm, know. I'm just offering no. a potential I do solution. take the phone. It doesn't, it yeah. just. Would you trust different. him I'm doing mom. laundry? Would you trust him to do laundry? Not mine. <laughs> <laughs> he can do his own all day long. Because I honestly, he's never done laundry before in his entire life. That because is well, absolutely For not those true. of you that don't know, I mean, you may have went to college, but I guarantee you brought all of it home for your mother or your grandma. He lived with his mother until his house was built, and then after his house was built, he put a ring on my finger, and I took over. Well, okay, make sure the he also here. did not take care of his own checkbook. Remember time management? <laughs> his, his mother did his checkbook until I came along. He... I just, I just don't know what to say, guys. You would be lost without her. Yeah. That's what I'm trying to say. And here. you would be bored without him. No. I think you would. I think so too. <laughs> no. You two would be lost. I would be each enjoying other. life so much. Love you. <laughs> See? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Love you, but you drive me crazy. All right. So how I love we you say both. it? I think you guys are great. <laughs> I really don't, I don't see no problems here so far. <laughs> yeah, I don't either. I mean, y'all are both laughing. I've been through all yes. of those things and there are no problems. Mm -mm. That is a normal marriage. No, it isn't. No. It's terrible. I tell her all the time she has no idea what kind of catch she has. How and I tell you all the time that you could, everyone would return you if you left to go to somebody else. I don't else. think so. I've met some other individuals that uh, I think you could have done worse than me. If you moved in with any other woman, they would say, get out. You want to experiment and find out? Go. I told you. <laughs> Go. See what happens. Are you giving him a free test drive? <laughs> Not in the department you're thinking of. In all other departments, carry on. <laughs> See, I just need, I told her one day, I said, I just need to find one that's good at laundry, one that's good at cleaning. <laughs> Just, that's the modern marriage. So you're saying that your wife is I wake better up that than morning 15 and I'm like, other wives? I need to find me a dishwasher. <laughs> <laughs> right. You're helpless. He uh, is, and then complains about the grocery. I will ask him before I go get the groceries. Is there anything you want me to pick up? I am so easy to grocery shop for. I eat like three things. <laughs> Pepsi, I, chicken yeah. fingers. And I am aware. Oh, and I have, excuse me, I have those things every mm -hmm. time. I have all the things that he likes. But he will still stand in the cabinet or in the refrigerator and be like, I have nothing to eat. So well, he just, he let he him just went to the grocery store. Here's the, and it's let him filled with everything. Yeah. But here's the problem. She I goes, do let him suffer. Yeah, I, he will go to the market and get what he needs. So here's the problem is she goes grocery shopping for a week. She'll get like five Lunchables. There's four of us in the family. That will have he to is a half. grown mm, man. Why are you eating a bite-sized Lunchable that takes two freaking bites to get done. Because nobody buy lunch meat. <laughs> there is lunch meat and in the fridge, bread really and cheese every time. Yeah, they're really bad for you. You don't want them. Okay, but they're for the children, for their lunchbox, because it's easy. I take it out, I put it in the lunchbox, mm -hmm. away you go. With all the other That's things the that I throw out, in there. Same theory applies over here. I take it <laughs> out, put it out, the way I go. Time management again. Time management. <laughs> I, I mean, I got a quick question. Are you at least buying your own Pepsis now? Thanks to I Wade. do not buy Pepsis. <laughs> Can we visit that story? <laughs> Ooh, I don't buy Pepsis. I don't buy why don't the chocolate buy, milk. Why don't you buy Pepsis? Because I don't drink them. No, because of Wade. This, mm, oh, I wasn't, that wasn't for you anyway. That wasn't because that wasn't the buying. That was the stocking the fridge. That was the stocking the and fridge. giving to you. Yeah. Do you stock the fridge now? No. No, still don't. 
Unless he leaves them on the floor and they're in my way and I get irritated after so many days. You should but I have I have coached Macy into it. We trade we trade stuff. <laughs> you trade things. Yeah, it's uh, that's one thing that's another place where I uh, excel over here is negotiating now. Bartering. <sighs> Macy, you want your allowance this week? I yeah. need my Pepsi's put in the fridge. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> you want your phone back? You're not done yet, girl. <laughs> You Maybe phones were a good part of technology. You're terrible. Huh? You're terrible. Terrible why they be, but look who's mm. married to me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm tired of hearing that. It's old. No, it ain't. It is. It puts a smile on your face every <laughs> time you hear it. <laughs> no, it does It may be a sarcastic <laughs> smile, but... It uh, is terrible. <laughs> science shows that even a sarcastic smile puts you in a better mood. Well, dang. All right, so all in all, in all seriousness, after Listen how many long have we been together? I don't know. 2004. September of 2004. Time. Huh? Time. Time to get married. Oh, September of 2004 is when we started dating. April 21st, 2007 no, is when we got married. When we first started dating? At what time? September 3rd, 2004 is when we first started dating. When we met in August. Oh. No. We met before that, but I didn't. I didn't know I met him. Yeah, yeah I, bet I left such an impression. I, I didn't know I met him. Impression. We had that conversation. You were working at bowling alley, weren't you? Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I didn't know I met him. That was in like let me. She's something. like four years younger than me. She was in college. I just got out of school. I was working no. full time job. You're four years younger than me. Yes, I was not in college yet. Oh, she was going to college. She just graduated high school. Oh. So I'm like, let's take this slow. Let's not get serious. I said that because I just got out of a relationship. Oh. That was four years long. Next thing I know, she's quitting college and moving in with me like three weeks later. He, oh my gosh. We're not going to, we're, Was we're this not. a barter? <laughs> we're not. <laughs> For time management? <laughs> no, it was, this was like, listen, I need my laundry done. Are you going to do it or do you find somebody else? <laughs> <laughs> I am almost out of clothes. <laughs> she's like, is this a uh, lifetime deal or a part-time deal? Like, this is a lifetime deal. So what have we been together? 18-ish years, something of that yeah, nature? that's crazy. Man, that's a long time. Yeah. It's amazing how much better looking I've got over 18 years. It's crazy. Mm. <laughs> you don't part your hair in the middle anymore. So that's <laughs> <laughs> you got that going for you. Oh. It's because he wears a hat all the time. Well, the ironic part, we've covered this before. The ironic part is, is like I literally moved to Derby and married the neighbor because she grew up like yeah. right next door. And we, yep. I, I didn't, I truly didn't know her when I started building this house. No, I didn't know you. Either. So it's kind of weird how it all. All ended up working out or better. Well, you love me, don't you? Most days. Yeah. You know, back to the laundry thing real quick. She gets mad at me. She gets mad at me. She's like, yeah, she's like, why do you wear the same pants three days in a row? I'm like, I know your habits. I got to barter. I got to ration my stuff. (laughs) I do the same thing. Like, no, I know if I wear every clean pants in there, you won't have okay. any. Like, at some point, I, I'm going without pants. I <laughs> so, I don't get the clean ones out. Like, I don't get the last pair of yeah. clean ones out until I see my dirty pants in the washing machine. I'm like, oh, thank good. I can, I can yeah. spare the last pair. I understand <laughs> the rewearing of jeans. I have done it. Yes. Not to the extent of this nonsense, but the rewearing. Yeah, but those are so much more comfortable the second day. It's true. Okay, but the rewearing of t-shirts when you do that really irritates me. I don't do that. <laughs> just, I, I just put do on a time. daggone clean shirt. Well, you gotta step up the laundry game, man. Do your own. I don't have time. time yeah, see, more. it amazes me. Get more I shirts. buy him <laughs> new Dirt Perfect shirts all the time. And pants and hood, all the things. Somehow, they disappear. Yeah, where go. they have gone, where you take your shirts off. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let's, let's answer that question. Yes. Where are you taking your where shirts off? Where are you taking your shirts off that are not in the laundry room? <laughs> that's that's a whole I need other, to know. That's a whole other <laughs> podcast. <laughs> that sounds like an OnlyFans. of Mr. Dirt Perfect. <laughs> yeah. That's an OnlyFans and an eBay item. <laughs> They've showed up in some weird spots before. <laughs> <laughs> I don't, and now some. I don't think I ever told you about this one, but oh, geez. you know, whenever you pull out on Highway 70 and 37, which is like a major intersection here in the county, mm-hmm. I went up there one day and there was all my hoodies was hanging on the side up there. Really? <laughs> I get to pull out back in my truck, <laughs> somebody hung it up on the side. <laughs> Stopped her perfect. <laughs> <laughs> I 
take the dump board. Or, you know, you're out. Oh, it's dry now. Cool. <laughs> you're out there in the middle of nowhere. You got to take that emergency number two. You just use your, take your you shirt off. Nothing. That's what the sock's for. Oh, yeah. the sock. Yeah. That's why we don't have socks. <laughs> <laughs> well, those I are always, the almost third perfect I always, <laughs> I always start it with the left sleeve first, then I'd move to the right <laughs> sleeve if I need it more. <laughs> Oh, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. This <laughs> so, topic. So, so next winter when you see the almost our perfect sleeveless t-shirt. <laughs> yes, you'll know. He went number two, number two. Yeah. Or number two twice. Yeah. And you'll, it could you'll, have been once. Yeah. He just said he moves to the other side. Uh, if he I guess it depends two. on what was for supper, huh? Taco yeah. Bell. <laughs> oh boy. Yeah. <laughs> and as far as leaving a drink in the shower, I mean, like, <laughs> get back to the time. <laughs> Managing, he does. Now, but like, <laughs> if you had that nice hot tub and you want to have a glass of wine and you drink I mean, I have a glass of wine when I'm sitting in the bathtub sometimes. Yes. Yes. So we can't really, but a Pepsi can in the shower. That's what he enjoys. Maybe that. So I take it you've probably had a beer in the shower. Is that what you're telling me? No, but my wife does all the time. And I, gotta, <laughs> I, gotta, I, gotta, I, I feel your pain because I got to get the beer cans out of the shower <laughs> so i know what you're talking about but that's maybe it's the last drink of the pepsi <laughs> under the shower that makes him feel i better guess if our biggest <laughs> marital problem is empty cans in the shower we're doing pretty good exactly that's why i said this marriage is perfect literally yeah <laughs> see i tried to tell you channel name married perfect yeah. <laughs> <laughs> There is no doubt we are definitely two very, very different people. Oh my, yes. I tell her all the time, if you just listen, we'll be fine. Mm. She's gotten better at it over the years. Oh my God. And I tell you all the time, you're not my dad. I already have one. <laughs> <laughs> right? Well, your dad would probably say the same thing. If you just listen, you'd be fine. <laughs> I mean, you're right. You probably would, but. Have I ever steered you wrong, dear? Dear, you have steered us in a whole lot of interesting We're still directions going. still good so we covered this in some other podcasts but i think it's worth pointing out that we i literally got married quit my job and became self-employed all the same week mm -hmm. so that was interesting i do want to say since we're talking about marriage and counseling and all the things yeah. i highly suggest living with someone before you marry them Except because I'm pretty positive, had we why? married each other, I mean, had we lived together before we got married, and I found out all We did this. live together before we got married. No, we didn't. No, we did. No, we didn't. How were you not doing his laundry? <laughs> well, she yeah. did not live, technically. I mean, she lived right next door, technically. I mean, I was over there. Oh, so you would just come down. Yeah, so technically, laundry. I did not. we did uh, not I did not go back to in the morning, but technically, she lived up there. Yeah, technically speaking, it was different. <laughs> I wasn't fully moved in until I got a ring on my finger, basically. Which was like... But I'm just saying, live together before you get married, because this, nobody, nobody want to put up with that Whenever she finally moved in, it was hook, line, and singer. I had her. <laughs> Young, dumb, stupid love. <laughs> <laughs> I was 19, young and dumb. Equals happy marriage. I mean, I've, are they seem pretty happy. Very happy, happy. yes. You wouldn't have changed a thing. Mm, probably a few. I think. I tell it all the time. The smiles to each other, I mean. They're no, that there. smile's gone. <laughs> <laughs> One of the smiles has left the building. I tell it all the time, you have no idea how lucky you are. You have said that probably five times this evening. I have no idea how lucky you are. Can we I say it one more time? <laughs> I think it is the other way around. The only reason I you say it is I know, know it how. aggravates her. <laughs> it does. Because it, it, mm. the one thing I figured out is how to push those buttons. God, yeah, you do know how to do that. I'm a master of that. Love <laughs> <laughs> how Mike picked it up. Busted. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> yeah, got it. All right, so we'll kind of wrap this up here yeah. a little bit. So all in all, I am Superwoman. You, <laughs> you are not. That's what we have covered this evening. I do all the things, so I'm Superwoman. You are. They're perfect. Yeah. So I don't contribute anything to our household. 
I like I mean, this. Wait, hold on. Oh, wrong one. Nope. <laughs> Where's the crickets? <laughs> there. <laughs> I didn't say nothing. I need a label for them. But Super you. Superheroes. I mean, this, I guess. <laughs> Superwoman and Dark Perfect is now a superhero. The dynamic duo. Yes. Yeah. We're going to get our own comic. Cartoons. Book. We're going to come out with a cartoon next. <laughs> yeah. Included with every perfect. purchase of the man behind the scenes calendar. <laughs> Super perfect. <laughs> Super perfect. <laughs> Ooh, I like that. <laughs> Super, perfect. Super perfect. I love it. <laughs> Something else to try, Mark. Uh, uh, oh, goodness. And that happened right here on this podcast while yep. I was in the middle of it. So look at that. I got to tell you later about the Christmas present we're going to make for them. Oh, no. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's going to be good. <laughs> Yep. I can only imagine. I know. <laughs> Sounds so exciting. So I'm, I'm just still waiting to hear what I contribute to the household because apparently nothing so far. Crickets? I mean, let the cricket speak. <laughs> <laughs> you provide stability. A, a certain <laughs> service. <laughs> you provide stability. For us what? to do the things. So you're nicely trying to say you keep me around for my money. I mean. Yeah, kind of. <laughs> yeah. It sounds like. I mean, nice I could survive on my own. I got a good job and all the things. You know, I have the insurance. But. <laughs> how many times that's been thrown in my face? It's over not. Here? I mean, do you, yeah, I have to throw it in your face. Because you know how many so, times you have thrown in my face the fact that I don't make as much as you. And I throw it back that I have our insurance. So it's been my. Go to battle. That's our go-to battle weapon for however many I have years. Your jerks, leave me alone. <laughs> exactly. That's why I get to be what I am and get my summers off and super perfect. That's super right. Perfect. I get to be super perfect. Mm -hmm. That is a really catchy oh, thing. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you might you're, want to change the channel name. You're the I know. One. It's super perfect. perfect. <laughs> yeah. Give Mrs. me a super perfect. cool Superwoman cartoon yeah. character. Yep. Man. All right, well, we'll that wrap. That could be my logo. It could be. Man. Did you ever make a logo? I mean. Is that a sore subject? Not the word love with yet. Oh. We're getting there. By we're, you mean both of these? No. No. I mean. I I remember, were, I don't do me, anything. I thought they were working together on something. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> no. Every time I get one back, he doesn't say anything. Mm -hmm. So it's like, okay. He's not my logo. If I do I know, say but something, I want she's your not. Opinion. She's not uh, very kind. No, you're just very nitpicky about things, and I'm not, not that way. Maybe it's because well, you haven't I mean, had the right name yet. Maybe. Super perfect. Super, Super perfect. perfect. Hmm. All right, we'll wrap this up. So, all in all, YouTube has been. Can positive. you say that one more time? What's that? We're it could be a washing up. machine with That'll a cable. That'll be five on. times you said that. Yeah. Now. <laughs> hold on, hold on, you count? Yeah. I got this. It could be a washing machine with a cape. There it is. <laughs> <laughs> Can I have something a little bit better than a washing machine? The problem a is, <laughs> <laughs> if you're going to make, phone. If you're gonna, if you're gonna make that t-shirt, you're going to have to put instructions on the back so she knows how to use them. <laughs> See, she was laughing. Easy. That is not <laughs> funny because you know how many things I've had to figure out on my own? What? Everything. <laughs> no, everything. you don't figure out anything. You call me. This is broke. That's not working. This light's on my dash. The washing machines. When's the last time you fixed the washing machine? I mean, I. I mean. <laughs> when's the last time you fixed okay. your car? Do you want to tell them that our washing I feel like machine? This, I feel like this household would be better if there was no washing machine in it. <laughs> Okay, the washing machine. I always tell the story like no, two weeks after we got married, no. she's like, we need a dishwasher. I'm like, I thought I married one. <laughs> the washing machine that we have right now has all these cycles and all these buttons and all these things. The only cycle that works is quick. That's 25 minutes. Light mode. Nothing Just like else. Me, nice every quick, other, light load. every <laughs> other cycle stops in the middle and leaves water sitting in the, in the thing. Time hmm. management. All I heard was, only one that works is 25 minutes. All I and heard was sometimes it, it rips our clothes. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like you need a new washing well, machine. Well, good news. We do. Yeah. I've been saying that for over a year now, but nobody wants to do that. We Merry want to spend Christmas. our money. No. No. <laughs> I'm not getting a washing machine for Christmas. Why? 
Because I don't want you, my guashi. I don't want a piece. I don't want that for Christmas. I want you, you to just go and buy that for me because I got that's her the what best gift ever for Christmas last year. <laughs> the wall vacuum. That I don't ever get to use. It that's great. sitting right probably back there on that covered in grease. <laughs> Which one is it? The one up on top of there? Yeah, see it. Oh, is. I got one. I love that thing. Yeah, he t he bought that for me for Christmas, and it I've used it twice maybe because well, he keeps. Why did you ask for that? I didn't. Well, Jenna, Jenna, when you I didn't ask, ask for it. Then why are you mad that oh. he has it? Because I was going to use it for my car. Oh. Hey. You got to tell me I bought you a new car? You bought me a new car. <laughs> <laughs> also, going back to that. the washing machine, <laughs> the, the laundry room the car was right <laughs> now has a disco Your Honor, why are you two it? getting divorced? Wait, what? Hold on. Why are you two getting divorced, the washing machine? <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> yeah, seriously. <laughs> It doesn't really the... have a disco light, but the light goes like this oh. for a good 10 minutes. And then it'll be like, okay, I'm ready. <laughs> this no. goes back to time management. You wake we up, you turn the light it. on, you do your thing, you come back as good. We haven't fixed it. <laughs> we haven't fixed it. It's just not truly broke. It's just not behaving. How do we, we haven't we, fixed it. How do we portray so, a disco light inside the washing machine on Super Perfect's logo? <laughs> uh, you make this happen. I, I'm sure someone out here can. Well, I'm sure some people would appreciate a shirt that flashes you. <laughs> <laughs> Not what you're wearing. I it. think you got uh, the joke. Oh, got it. Uh, most people got the joke. I'm pretty sure. Jenna, did you get that? Yes, I got it. <laughs> <laughs> got it. <laughs> No comment or no flash? It's like, like no comment. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, she said no comment. Yes. No so flash either. Has a chance. Neither. Yeah. None of the above. I know you, like got the, the, uh, you got the beat button. You got the blur button. <laughs> <laughs> Can we just buzz him out? Uh, Your time is yeah, done. done. Like on, uh, what's that? Um, you are the weakest link. Goodbye. Yeah, or turn your, spin your chair around instead of saying, yes, we like you, spin it. Nope, you're done. That's uh, the voice. Yeah, that's what I'm trying uh, to think of. Good, okay, I have to go to the bathroom anyways. Oh. Peace out. And to wrap this up, right. because uh, he is yes. just... Be nice to me while I'm gone. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> mm. Oh, boy. Now that he's gone. Mm -hmm. Yeah, now that he's gone. He can't hear you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, and it'll be uh, how long until this is. I mean, we. Going? I feel like we've been going forever. I don't know though. Oh, we're well, whenever. Yeah, we, we're over. We just passed an hour. So now you can say what you want. Yeah. I mean, I said well, what about, I wanted when he was here. Okay. <laughs> Would and, you consider that to be part of a healthy relationship? Speaking your mind. Mm-hmm. Mm. Got to speak your mind. Yes, you have to. Especially mm -hmm. about the washing machine. Especially about the washing machine. Yeah. It's an issue. Mm -hmm. it needs fixed. Yeah. You, that's why you need to come back to work. Yeah, we're it needs fixed, and my disco light needs fixed. Please I'm just thinking you. Christmas is right around the corner. We're going to have that in there by Christmas. Mm -hmm. New one? A new one. Yeah. I think so. I think so. I think that'd be a great idea. Yep. Mm -hmm. I do too. Mm -hmm. I mean, have you, have you picked one out that you want? No. Oh. We need to do that. Yeah, we maybe, maybe do that. that and then yeah. yeah. We can start leaving like subliminal hints. Mm -hmm. That's like, a good idea. Like pictures of washing machines. I'm just like, going to tell them. washing machine that you want. Like, I'm, stuff I'm just going to tell them since I will be back by then. I'm just yeah. going to tell them, hey, we're going to get this washing machine. Yeah. Perfect. So you got his mic on yet? I can hear the toilet flushing. <laughs> <laughs> I heard it too. <laughs> I mean, can you imagine going down to the market? <laughs> can you imagine going down to the market and sticking the, that, that picture in the cooler where the Pepsi is? <laughs> <laughs> And you could, you'd have to use like the, the roll on glue yes. so he couldn't even peel it off. Yes. Yeah. Get it on good. Yeah. He's <laughs> walking away. Bye, Bye. buddy. Uh, we, we need to get it on like, you know, maybe at least a case of cans. Yeah. That's what I was thinking. You fold it up and stuff mm -hmm. it in the can maybe. Hmm. Yeah. You know, he'll get the hint eventually. Now my, my fear would be that he'll be stubborn and, and purposely not get that one. Oh yeah, that is exactly what will happen. Oh we, my God, you oh still, Lord. yeah. <laughs> what month is that? I guess that must be a cold one. He must, yeah. be, is, uh, he must be wearing that flashy shirt you were talking about. Um, it says 2021. Should we show the camera? Yeah. Okay, yeah. Hey, yeah, we Brand can show the camera. <laughs> 
Yeah. Good thing that wasn't on during the live. We didn't have that. Yeah. 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 It sits on his background of his shelf all the time. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's where it needs to be. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This right here, folks, is the start of my calendar and my <laughs> the modeling. modeling career. Are we going to get the monetized yeah. for it? Well, we probably should. The package is small enough, you don't see it much, so. <laughs> <laughs> what does it say mm -hmm. on it? It says. Working man. Working man. Well, well yes. It is 2021. Yeah. I didn't do one for this year. I'm running out of time. Oh, boy. <laughs> I do have an outfit for it. Jason, you want to take the pictures? No. <laughs> <laughs> no, not really. <laughs> All right. Michael, you want to put your mic back on so you can wrap this up? Then? Oh, now, now you need me, huh? Well, you no. Wrap it, it, up. Was, it was a courtesy. Because you remember when he, what was it he was saying that he said like five times? Something about being with me. Oh with yeah, me. I tell her all the time, you're so lucky mm -hmm. or something. I don't yeah. know. No, I block the, it out. No, the other one he was saying, cause you're like, that's like the fifth time you've told me tonight. Oh yeah. How lucky you are to be with me. No, no, and you said the other one. Oh, the, the, uh, an idiot I may be, but. Look who married me. <laughs> yes, that one, and you're like, you've said that five times now. Well, this will be like the fifth time that he says, okay, we're gonna wrap it up. So here's the real question. Slide yep. over here. There <laughs> we go. Got a rolling chair. <laughs> <laughs> I don't. I'm in a. You're I'm on, in a bouncy chair. You're on the, the driver's seat for Lieutenant Dan. Yep. <laughs> okay. Why did you have to come over here? Would what? you tell the world that we are happily married? <laughs> We're married. <laughs> <laughs> We're happily married Let's most try. of the time. Let's try this again. Yes. Now, and don't roll your eyes. Either repeat this after time. me. Blink three times if you need help. <laughs> <laughs> repeat after me. Repeat after me. I realized today. <laughs> no, I'm not repeating after you. <laughs> just, let's just go with this. We're just, I realized Real today. I realized today. Get off my ears. That I am. That I am. Truly the luckiest woman in the world. <laughs> go ahead. No. Come on, you can do it. Mm -mm. You're an English teacher. No. It's just words. <laughs> no. No. It's too many words. Not the right words. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, uh, I'm super excited this went well tonight. <laughs> I did so thank far. All, I, I think the referees need some credit here. I think yeah. I'm gonna thank yeah. all my friends. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> you wanna thank the marriage counselor. Our marriage counselor. Yeah, and the referee. Yeah, yeah, and no the problem. marriage counselor that is questionably happily married. I'm glad we could be here to help you guys out. The yeah, referee yeah. that don't have a striped yeah. shirt on. <laughs> Yeah. We'll get one for the next show. Yeah, appreciate yeah. that. Yeah. So basically, what they're saying is it takes a village. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. There you go. That's what it, you know, that's it's what amazing. It, it is village. amazing how well we get along on the day she listens. I was going to say the days that we're here, but I mean, I just things like that make me want to smile. <laughs> but look how There's much video you make him smile. <laughs> you make him smile so big. He I guess it's really the podcast. We can just see like he talks a big game, but he does really love me, guys. He yeah, does. Let's and say and we're gonna put this on a scale. I'll go with seventy percent of the time. <laughs> Wait, so scale funny. would be like seven out of ten. Not a percentage. We're gonna put a percentage on it. We're gonna put a percentage on it. It's like a seven. It's out a 10. seven out of ten to seventy percent. Yeah. <laughs> can you wrap this up? Hey, here in Pennsylvania. <laughs> How much not, longer? <laughs> He's Are you going to talk? I oh, know I'm getting the hip, babe. We'll wrap it up. No. <laughs> why do you do that? It's so annoying. Because it drives you crazy. That's exactly why. So. All right. Hold on, guys. Well, okay, guys. We're going to wrap this up. <laughs> <laughs> we're going to wrap it up. Oh, yeah. One last question for you. We're going to wrap it up. Have we you ever one? given the, him the an idiot I may be, but look who married me? No, because I hate it so much. <laughs> <laughs> what? We're gonna go. Well, you We're gonna say one more thing about being married. What is it? No, I was gonna just say overall. Would you say YouTube's been a good thing for the family? I we have already done this. No, we haven't. We got sidetracked on <laughs> all the other stuff. We said it in the beginning. That was the first part of this. Then yes. We, then we walked into marriage counseling. <laughs> that was that was tonight. Can that I wasn't say yesterday. No, one, it was tonight. Can I say one thing that really drives me crazy what about thing? YouTube? What thing? Can I say? Wait, 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 hold on. YouTube or YouTube? <laughs> YouTube. Okay, got it. I got scared. I thought we were in trouble. 
is how many times you repeat yourself about things. <laughs> Drives me nuts. So it's not really YouTube. It's a you. <laughs> so, it's a you so, it was, so let's keep the tube out of it. It's you. <laughs> I mean, how many times do you have to say <laughs> all the things? I know all the things. Like, comment, and subscribe. I'm oh, sorry. I'm there perfect. <laughs> oh, my, my God. I don't think I've ever, I don't think I've ever said that. I don't know. Oh, God. I can't think of anything right now. <laughs> but but I'm going uh, to save that clip and turn it into a button. <laughs> Oh yeah. <laughs> I'm <they're> perfect. <laughs> I'm <they're> perfect. <laughs> <laughs> or like you, the inflections in your voice when you say certain things <laughs> really drives me nuts sometimes too. <laughs> now we're getting somewhere like, the truth is coming out. What is she well, drinking? <laughs> it's what buble bubbly water. Oh. Will Catch you on the next one. <laughs> I'm there perfect. <laughs> you say that sometimes. Cartoon is going to be great. <laughs> <laughs> See, look oh at this. Look God. how much she's laughing. <laughs> she's smiling. She's laugh. loving it. Yes, <laughs> <laughs> I got a few things I'd like I really to say. Wish oh. I could think of <laughs> no. right hey, now. thank you all for listening. <laughs> yeah. Thank you all for watching. I was going to say, but I'll, I'll let her have her moment. Yeah. <laughs> this is a good moment in the spotlight. <laughs> <laughs> I got it. Wow. Well. <laughs> We're done. Oh. <laughs> Anything else you'd like to add? Dude? No. I can't think of any of them. This was getting good. Is yeah. there any way we can put this at the beginning? I think so. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I guess that's a wrap. You gotta tell them. We're gonna wrap this up again. <laughs> yeah. What now? Oh my god! I keep trying to wrap it up, but you won't let me. Yeah. Just wrap it up and end it. Okay. And they're perfect. <laughs> <laughs> you got. Since I can't do it, you gotta tell them to uh, do all the things. You know. No, I want to hear you do it. Go. I don't even know what to say on the bottom. But it really <laughs> irritates you, so you <laughs> gotta do it. <laughs> She's a glutton for There's a lot of things that really irritate her, but yeah. she wants me to do them. <laughs> <laughs> All right. That's, that is a wrap. We're not going to wrap it up. That is a wrap. We're done. So hopefully you guys enjoyed the podcast. If you do, hit the buttons, do your thing, and we'll catch you on the next one. We're he out. changed it up. <laughs>